We realised at Arpare that there was an opportunity for teams to actually take on additional support from us in order to do risk their technologies further so that they would attract more investment, be able to grow out their customer base and also build out and validate the capability of their technologies. We were looking for teams that potentially their technology could be stranded in, in some way and needed an additional amount of funding in order to demonstrate them. And we saw that in Bridger Photonics as an opportunity for us and a very good candidate for the scale-up program. Our goal is to make emissions reduction simple for the oil and gas community. And so what we've come up with is a proprietary sensor that we attach to aircraft and we fly over oil and gas infrastructure throughout the entire natural gas value chain. We don't sell the equipment, we hand our clients a map that pinpoints and images and quantifies every important emission in the infrastructure. There's kind of this continuum of technologies. You have satellites in space that can detect these very large emission events, and so that could be important. Or you could have technologies on the ground that are very sensitive, but they don't provide that complete spatial coverage that we do, and they can't be deployed as efficiently over our client's infrastructure. And so we're really in this efficient, sensitive sweet spot in our deployment. Our heritage is in topographic LIDAR, and that got us our start as a company. Through the ARPA E program, we began to incorporate atmospheric LIDAR. And at first, we actually were selling both as data products. Eventually, we learned that folks uh, didn't know what to do with the topographic LIDAR and the value to them was really in the, in the atmosphere quite our. And instead of measuring solid objects, we measure gas plumes. We're able to image gas plumes. Our laser beam scans out their infrastructure in this helical pattern, so we get this forward and reverse look at the infrastructure. So we create like that three-dimensional digital twin of the infrastructure on the ground and three-dimensional twins of the methane gas plumes. And that's really important for our analytics because that gives us so much data that we can work with to do equipment identification to quantify those methane plumes. From those analytics, we're developing the capabilities to really show our clients where it's going to be most cost effective to reduce emissions and where, you know, where's the biggest bang for their buck for emissions reductions. It took us, what, three or four years to, to really get to the point where we could offer a product, a LiDAR product, and really sell data. So that was started in 2015. We released commercially in 2019. That's when it just took off. Last year, we caught an aggregate emission rate of 560,000 kilograms per hour. Now, if you assume all those emitters were continuous in time throughout the whole year, which isn't true, but okay, it's, it's getting there and then you convert that to how much emissions were in that entire year, 4.9 million metric tons. That's 58% of the entire United States emissions according to the EPA. We're getting a ton of adoption in the production sector. We're in pretty much every major production base in, in the US, but there's still so much to be done out there that we're just gonna keep growing in, in all of those sectors. It's been really cool to be involved in an area that's rapidly growing like this. I've always kind of wanted to be at the frontier of some sort of new field where, you know, things are happening rapidly and there's so much opportunity for growth and innovation. I've never experienced anything like what we're going through right now in my life. I think I will only get one of these in my life. So we're all in. Like, this is our moment to push as hard as we possibly can. I want all our crew to be able to look anyone in the eye and say, when their grandparents look at their grandkids and say, yeah, I was part of the solution to this problem. And yeah, we go to work every day with that in mind.